Hey there, this is Yotun Gelo. Check this out. So I'm a copywriter basically and uh, online marketing strategist. See where my office is. It's actually uh, right at the top floor of a bookstore. Biggest bookstore in Helsinki, Finland. That's a pretty apt place to have an office, don't you think? So whenever I want some inspiration or I need to get some book that I'm missing, hey, just plop down downstairs and go get it. Pretty nifty, huh? Let's take a look around. And now for the really important thing, how the coffee gets made. So, what's it gonna be today? Uh, let's go for the dark, the Guatemalan, this time, all right. And here we go. So anyway, uh, let's talk about copywriting for a minute. Um, since that's probably what you're interested in. Um, one thing about, you know, there's a word called essentialism, and it's basically the same thing as, you know, just doing the bare minimum of what you need to get a result. And I think a lot of people are intimidated by copywriting because they perceive that you really have to get everything right. And if you're writing like a high stakes sales letter or, or a video sales letter, that may be true but most people are not they're not working at a level you know where somebody lives or dies by the marketing i mean basically you should but <laughs> um, what i'm saying is that the 80 20 rule still applies and if you get just a few things right you don't have to worry about every damn thing okay so if you if you get people's attention uh if you get the promise right, you promise something uh, of value, something significant, uh, what's important to these people, get your proof right, and then you push them over the cliff uh, with scarcity, a proper call to action, uh, summarize the deal and whatnot. If you get, you know, like three, four things right, you're probably well on your way. And there's marketers who do that, and there's marketers who try to get everything right, and uh, most of the time uh, it's not needed and you also end up sounding pretty hypey. So just think about getting just a few things right. How to get people's attention? Um, how do you get uh, the right promise to them? The, and then prove to back it up and then uh, how to get them to act. Just four things. If you get those right, you're pretty much on your way. Of course, there's a lot of detail and there's a lot of tactics involved in which you can apply, and we'll get to that later. Right now, I just wanted to, um, you know, lower the bar a little bit for you because a lot of people uh, come up, come up to me with the, with these same concerns. It, uh, it's so demanding. So at least get those right. Okay, so you're well on your way after that. Anyway, I'm just uh, trying to get get back into the habit of doing videos for you. Um, been taking a little bit of a break, but uh, I'm trying to get back there. Talk soon.